All right, hi everybody, and welcome from another snowy Michigan Friday. Uh, seems to be on the calendar every Friday. We get a little nice white surprise here lately. I have never seen flakes that big. I, honest to God, last night they were um, they were huge. Uh, today we're going to talk a little bit about a couple things. We're going to talk about grit, and thanks to everybody who submitted. Uh, nominations for people with grit uh, and that's an ongoing process by the way so keep them coming uh, we're going to start that process of uh, illuminating those who have grit talk about grit I'm going to make a book recommendation about grit but uh, grit is an incredibly incredibly important aspect probably the most important aspect of life in general and success and it can it's not something that you're necessarily born with it is something you can grow and nurture get yourself an environment and um, honestly, uh, get around people that exhibit grit and you'll pick it up. It's like hanging out with smarter people. You kind of get smarter after time. It's kind of a cool thing. Also, we're gonna switch over to um, some talk about what's coming up with the company celebration as we're right into the mid-March season uh, with St. Patty's Day coming up too next week. Uh, but it is the month of celebrating 40 years and we've got some great events coming up. We wanna talk about those. So just driving back to uh, what we talked about uh, grit and the power of passion and perseverance which is the key to it and is actually the title of the book that we're going to recommend um, i wanted to um, start by uh, talking about a few of the people in our in this organization that have some a true grit um, and do exemplify that every day so from the list of nominees i'm going to go through these um, i'm going to start with john garai john Comments, a great mentor, a get it person in general, has taught me so much here at Post Holdings, working for CSM, has always let me find my way, but also is always there for me. Just an incredible way to lead. And John, I, for those of you that know John and been around John, know that John exhibits that on a daily basis. All right, Jim Miles, it's not just a manager, Jim is a true leader. He never stops thinking about others, his team, his customer, his company, and the success of all while putting his needs last. Jim handles difficult conversations and situations while ensuring others sense they are valued. He is inclusive and a director simultaneously ensuring everyone is part of success. Through quiet confidence, Jim will continue to mature his fellow employees and guide the team to long-term continuous results. It's a pleasure to work with Jim in all situations. Thank you, Jim. Whitney Bartz. As someone on the HR team who has the privilege of working somewhat closely with Whitney, I've had the chance to witness her perseverance to lead company-wide initiatives during times of transition. And I really believe this is why Whitney is one who will stand firm when it matters most, providing us with a stability that creates opportunities for growth over time. Thank you, Whit. Brian Roy. Brian has stepped up the plate on many projects over his many years at CSM with a great personality and always truthful attitude and humor, I might add. He is a great asset to the team and always a mentor. Over the past few months of working with Brian on his current project that was set with high expectations and who some might think is an impossible schedule, Brian has stepped up to push completions and work with everyone in an effort to keep multiple phases going at once. Here's to all the gritty you've shown and continued success, Brian. Thank you. Brian Beaver. Brian displays a commanding demeanor but also is conscientious. Careful, vigilant, perseverance, and resilience, all are Brian's attributes. With a level of his passion for his trade and team, he does not hesitate to be the first one in or the last one out. Hashtag Team Beaver. Josh Rose. Josh always shows interest in you and what you have to say. Always available and willing to talk and address issues of concerns if they come up. He cares about those around him and helps to make them better. Thank you, Josh. Bruce Zakay. Bruce has never shied away from a challenge and has time and again charged directly into the storm. He's an extraordinary leader and is always there to help his team however they need. He is an amazing PD. He is very calm, approachable, and handles very challenging clients and owner's reps. I appreciate Bruce every single day. Could not ask for a better teammate. Thank you, Bruce. Marissa Poth Miller. Marissa's sheer determination, dedication to the success of both her fellow coworkers and her clients is outstanding. She has time and time again stepped up to the challenge posed in front of her 
and not shied away. Thank you, Marissa. Katrina Reed, constant perseverance and effort to meet not only our department goals, but company goals. She is an amazing leader. I concur. Thank you, Katrina. Bill Eichstead. Bill, since I've had the opportunity to work with you, I've been able to experience your strength of character and true grit. It is clear that you have a determination to excel, and that is shown from the second you walk on the job site and even after you leave. Thank you for being a driving force at DJF. In addition, in the few months I've been here, Bill has already grown as a leader. He has a determination of how to approach like no other. He puts in the time and effort to be successful every day, and he is first in line to pitch in for the team. Thank you, Bill. A huge shout out to everybody uh, for A, participating. Thank you for the nominations. Uh, thank you for recognizing those that have grit. And by the way, everybody's got grit. We can all develop grit. Um, and please keep them coming in. This is gonna be an ongoing series and how to grow grit, uh, what you see are the key characteristics. I love these comments, so uh, please keep them coming. Um, I'd like to uh, now uh, flash on the screen the book we recommend, Angela Duckworth's uh, Power of Passion and Perseverance. It's a great quick read and it be, does line up uh, exactly what we talked about last time, which is essentialism. And we'll continue to unpack that in further blogs as we go down the line here. So uh, now, next week, uh, Wednesday, you'll need your sweatshirt, hoodie, uh, for our Better Together celebration. If you haven't picked up your swag in the office, make sure you do it before next Wednesday. Uh, we're going to have a, a big 401 here uh, to celebrate at the midpoint of the month and uh, continue the 40th celebration of CSM. Uh, once again, uh, I can't thank you all enough for everything you do. We get the comments back from our key clients. Our top to tops, our uh, meetings are going extremely well right now. Uh, so, uh, you know, it's the old saying of how you do anything is how you do everything. And I am so proud of you all for doing that. Thank you so much. Be safe out there today. Take care.